Y'all ready? Let's go, let's go, y'all ready? Let's go, let's go. Hey, my connectors, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. Join the family if you like the food. It's the place to be. You come and have a little fun with your girl, can't see. Listen, what's up, my connectors, and welcome back to the channel. So today, we are finally having a seafood boil. So I have some um, Dungeness crabs. I have some shrimp, broccoli, potatoes, um, peppers, and some garlic butter sauce. So if you are new to the channel, if you could please hit your subscribe button and your notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video is uploaded. Don't forget to share, like, and leave me a comment. I truly appreciate it. I bet y'all say, yeah, we know the intro, girl. All right, let's jump in and eat, child, for the lights and all that cut off. <laughs> Oh, it's hot. As in heat. You can probably see the smoke. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Child, I tried a little new concoction today. <clears throat> I like, I like. I was tasting it as I was making it, so this wasn't one of my uh, surprise concoctions. Y'all can probably uh, hear the weather. Mm, mm, mm. That's good. I missed old Dungey. We're going to hurry up with this one, baby. Oh, that's good. I'm sorry. Can y'all see me breaking these? Y'all already told me you can't see when I be piling this stuff up here. Actually, I like the thunder, right? It's kind of calming. It seems like it calms everything down outside. But, baby, I got on lightning. I am scared, okay? I'm scared of the lightning. You? Yeah, girl. I'm scared. I don't like it. Mm-mm. Be like, sit down somewhere. Shoot. Mm. Oh, that's good. Um, hold on, I'm getting me a little piece of broccoli. The, the cayenne hit me in the throat a little bit. How y'all doing? You doing all right? I hope so. I 
the lights go to flickering. We're gonna go and on get up. <laughs> I don't care if this video five minutes. It's just thundering. It's not lightning or anything right now. Okay, I put me a little sausage up there, honey. You see the sausage? Mmm. Now the thing good. I like when that smoke come off the sauce. Well, it's hot, but don't burn your scald your tongue. Love it. We're gonna bite the sausage, then we're gonna talk. <laughs> Let me chew this up. We're gonna bite the side. Mm. I know somebody saying you can bite a bigger piece than that. Then if I do that, last time I did, that's my time. Now you that big, grown and nasty. <laughs> I'm like, that's your mind. Mm, that's good. I don't eat them often. But when I do, it's good. So. Thank y'all so much for watching yesterday's video. Y'all know I have to have a moment of gratitude every day. So that's my way of saying thank you. Just in case, one, I didn't see your comment or I didn't answer your comment or, you know, you think I, your support goes unnoticed. We always do daily gratitude. And when I say thank you, so that's our moment of gratitude. So thank you for watching yesterday's video. <laughs> Baby, <clears throat> I did not want to like it. That pizza is good. It was good. And you can get what you want on it. You ain't got to get all that. I didn't know they had it. Now, I ain't never said the pizza was good for you, okay? <laughs> now, I want about it to my neck. I can't see you. I just wanted to try. I just be wanting to try stuff. But it was good. Mmm. And then I wrote her name down. I think it was Destiny Renee. I want to say it was Destiny Renee. Let me see. Oh, no. Hmm. Huh. I did a screenshot, but um, remember I was telling y'all, hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah, Destiny Renee. So, y'all remember when I was telling you the bacon, I like my bacon, like, well, well done. And she was like, you can get it, you know, them to cook it more. Just have them cook it um, before they put it on the pizza and cook it while, when they put the pizza back in there. So, tell them to cook it twice. Thank you, girl. Because I, I have to have it well, well done. 
when I eat it. You know, I don't eat it often, but when I do eat it. So thank you, thank you. I love when y'all put me on. <laughs> y'all be looking at. Mm-hmm. Oh, and then one of y'all was like, had them cook your, you know, your pizza, the bottom of your pizza, or just have them put it in there twice. You know how you can put it in twice forever. However, many, however long it was supposed to cook it, do it twice if you want it. Cooked a little longer. It was so good to me, child. I was like, honey, <laughs> I will be getting it again, though. I will get it again. So, thank you to everybody that watched that. I know most people like seafood, but let me be trying little stuff, y'all. Mm-hmm. This sauce is bomb. Mm, mm, mm. I'm going to take a look at this shrimp. Listen, right? It was two things. Let me just do one. So I've seen a question on, I think it was on Shade Room, that asked, what store from the 90s or, you know, that has closed that you would love to see come back or that you miss? <clears throat> I ain't gonna lie. Is blockbusters. <laughs> I really do because it was just so cool to go rent your movies, take your movies back. I mean, even though you ain't got to do all that now, but it was just the, uh, it was a whole era, you know? We used to go to Blockbuster and wait for the new releases and go to that wall that had the new releases on it. I really enjoyed that. I don't, I don't, you don't know what you miss until it's, just, it's gone, but. I really like that. So I miss Blockbuster. Maybe it's because I have memories of going with Kit to go pick up movies or my family and we have movie night. I like movie night. And then another store, they said, um, they put it now. Let me show, let me tell you some of the stores they put in there. Circuit City, um, Toys R Us, they put, what were some of the other stores they put in there? I ain't gotta forget. But let me know what store that has closed or whatever back in the day that you missed. Oh, I am tell you who I miss. I miss Route 21 and Dots. That's who I miss. In the, in the back in the day Burlington. When Burlington had some really good stuff, I miss them. Cause I didn't, I don't, I don't shop at like high end stores and stuff like that. Cause you know I buy in bulk. <laughs> I gotta get a whole lot of stuff for my money. You know, I know can't be talking about it. it's quality over quantity, baby. I can take that little outfit and do something with it. So give me quantity. You know, every now and then, you know, you might buy something, you know, that you've been wanting for a while. But as far as me, I love buying in bulk. So if y'all could buy like 10 pair of shoes versus one, 
Yeah, and Burlington used to have some really nice shoes, like it came from other stores. You know when they used to get all the stuff from the high end stores and put them in Burlington and mark them all the way down. Last time I went in, I didn't know what was in there, but I don't know. I like stuff like that. I can't change it. I cannot change it. Mm-hmm. But yeah, that was one question I had to ask you. Let's see, what was the other question? Mmm. Me and Alicia were talking about this on the phone. Do you remember the song? Well, I know we always said that certain songs bring back certain memories of like what you was going through. I'm sorry, I probably got this so close y'all can't even see the food. Sorry. Yeah, but certain songs bring like certain memories of what you was going through or um, where where you were at, like where you in school or work during that time or you used to ride to work listening to it. Well, let me tell you, when me and Kate was going through our little rift of, you know, you know how you go through spats or whatever. You just have a rough year or whatever. Baby, when I tell you Fantasia got me through that. <laughs> Fantasia got me through that time. Every time I hear her song, like definitely five of them. If you don't want me done, don't talk to me. No, Free Yourself. That's the name of that one. And um, y'all let me know down below what song, whether it was gospel, whether it was rock, whether it was rap, that brings back a memory every time you hear it or makes you think of someone when you hear it. Uh, something like that. But that song, when I hear, if you don't want me, then don't talk to me. Baby, I was, especially like when you close your door and you mad at it, <laughs> you turn it all the way up. Or if he got to come in there and ask you something you sing real loud. Yeah, Fantasia. What's the other one? Um, It was five songs, like, back to back. Um, ain't she had some good breakup songs. Hold on, let me look real quick. Real quick, then we're going we gonna to wrap this up. But, yeah. <clears throat> And it's not like many like celebrities uh, that I, I'd be like, oh, you know, I'm so excited to meet her because we went on the cruise. I don't know if I ever told y'all this. We went on the Tom Joyner cruise, me, Alicia, and Diane. Shout out to my cousin, Diane. Um, and the Tom Joyner have all like the celebrities and stuff on there, which was so much fun. If y'all ever get to go, it was so much fun. And then they switched to Carnival. Y'all know I don't, I don't stay on Carnival. <laughs> sale on Royal Caribbean. I think they're back on Royal Caribbean. But anyway, that's besides the point. So anyway, Fantasia was on there. A lot of celebrities on there. Real cool people too. Because you know how sometimes you meet them and they be like, <laughs> it was only two people like that. That kind of looked at us and kind of rolled their eyes or whatever. But it was cool. But uh, Fantasia was one of the most down to earth people you ever want to meet. It's almost like you meeting your cousin. And I wouldn't expect any different because she's always, you know, gave that she always made you feel that way even like in her music or her interviews or whatever the case may be but she's always been like a down-to-earth person and um that reminds me somebody left me a comment to say casey i've been watching for a long time and you never switched up that means a lot to me because i really don't want to ever come off like i always want to be humble or whatever but listen <laughs> thank you for that comment uh let me do let me find fantasia song Ain't gonna beg you. How did I just forget that? Ain't gonna beg you was the one that really ain't gonna beg you. Keep cutting up. I ain't gonna beg you now. Keep keep it keep keep it up. <laughs> okay, so ain't gonna beg you. Um. Oh, got me waiting. You got me waiting. You got me waiting. Oh, that was my jam. Okay, so that one. Uh, free yourself. Mm, hold on. It was that album. So I'm trying to find the songs that was that album. I like Baby Mama. I'm doing me. Mm-hmm. Baby, them songs speak to you. Because everybody go through a little something every now and then. And, 
and you just be wanting to get it off your chest. So yeah, that album there for me, definitely, definitely got me through. Cause y'all know I don't fuss and cuss and do all that stuff. So I need a little therapeutic music. So when we sit down and address certain issues, I didn't got it all out my chest. <clears throat> mm-hmm. But yeah, child. You couldn't tell me I wasn't no uh Grammy Award winning singer on that thing. I used to have a broomstick, a brush in my hand. <laughs> Ooh, child. They take you there. Mm-mm. Then he got he, he he used to have jokes. Like after whatever happened, he'll be like, So was you playing that song that loud for me? And then a bus I laugh. Like, don't make me mad all over again. You was mad, huh? <laughs> oh he's so annoying, but yeah. Um, what's another song? Week. I can remember what I was doing at the time where I was, you know, who I was in, who I was involved with. Um, it's like three songs. I could definitely tell you. That's crazy. But anyway, we just right, came. Let me hurry up before the lights and stuff start flickering again. So one, let me know what store from the 90s that you would like to bring back. You can answer that one or you can answer question number two, question of the day. Or you can answer um, which song brings back a memory of a time period of your life that you probably will never forget. And every time you hear that song, it takes you back there. Like not triggering, but just makes you think about that time you went through. But anyway. Thank y'all so much for joining me. I really do appreciate it. Much love, peace, and blessings to each and every one of you. And until the next video, continue making connections with endless possibilities. I love y'all. Bye, y'all.